I, I don't believe in voodoo, so I, I don't know what all of that was about, but, I, you know, Deborah, I'll let you. Yeah. Oh, I'm a me, so. So, uh, firstly, we, we kind of saw it as a point of distraction, and we were able to still put our focus eye, regardless of whatever they believe in. We believe in God, and in God we stand, and we know with God all things are possible, so we don't care about the voodoo, you know. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So the Super Falcons of Nigeria played their last round of uh, Olympic qualifiers today with the Lionesses of Cameroon. They did their second leg in Abuja, Nigeria. So funny thing happened yesterday is as if they were doing juju. Cameroonian player just rushed inside the pitch, probably maybe kind of jazz or juju. So she ran into the office like breaking the uh, the siege or breaking uh, through the barrier so that they will be able to score. But in the end, they were not able to score. This happened uh, in the second half. The Cameroonian player just like she she made herself a football. So running inside the goalpost is as if. She has broken the barrier so that they can be able to score, but in the end, they are not able to score. So, this is yeah, head, head to head uh, statistics. This is like five, let's say, five the last previous you know, five matches the Lionesses of Cameroon have played with the Super Falcons of Nigeria. Nigeria has won three, drawn one, and Cameroon has won just one. The Lionesses of Cameroon they just won once, and that was even. A friendly match not afghan game or even World Cup qualifier so what was in the mind of this uh, Cameroonian player that made her just rush inside the the goal post what was in her mind was she trying to score a goal by herself or something is it that they use juju or maybe they, they believe or they felt like the super falcons of nigeria were using juju as well so it's just rushed inside the pitch i i i don't really understand here is what the nigerian coach and deborah abiodun had to say regarding that juju 